on the rescue team here. Go help us up. I'll stay here. As you can hear, the rescue teams are on their way. Meanwhile, Jake Martin, a WRCW employee, has descended the well in a desperate attempt to rescue Amanda Dillon and her mother. So what? Trevor Dillon, the father of his child, is here. Yeah, I warned you about this. All right. Uh, forget it. Come on. Boy, nothing gets through that iron heart of yours, does it? You know, Trevor, I found your little girl. Amanda doesn't know that Jan is her mother. Well, isn't that the worst kept secret in town? Boy, you really got to my family. First you killed Laurel. I didn't kill Laurel. Yes, you did. That's about as far as you're going to get. Hey! Hey! That is personal property! Hey, next time it won't be a camera, sweetie. Go get a camera. That little girl gets out of that well and I'll get it on the your fire. It's Colby, we don't... Move it! That's your fire. What? It's real great. It's an 18-wheeler jackknife took out a bus. The emergency wagon stuck in the... Jake, my man, I hope you're feeling good. Because we're doing this one by ourselves now. Nice and easy. All right, guys, we're almost ready. How's she back there? You think she's down? Yeah. Okay, listen, I'm going to come right back down for you. Don't worry about me, just put, go. I'm going to put a jacket on, okay? Right, sweetie, you ready? Here we go. Go. Wake up. Are you 
okay. Say anything. Janet, Amanda is going to be fine. How do you know? Is, is there a doctor with her? Please don't let my little girl die. I promise you. You can't promise her anything, man. So we're getting Amanda right now. Is her color back? Is she breathing okay? She's in good hands. How do I know that you're telling me the truth? I swear to you, Amanda is going to be fine. I'm going with Amanda. Go on, I'll stay here. Get out of here. She may be hypothermic. Uh, her blood pressure is 60. How? Pulse is 140 and Freddy. Let's go. All right. Let's get a line on her. Ready? Right, we're heading out. Respiration is 14 and we are here. We got two additional EMTs for the woman in the morning. Yep, right. Open her eyes. Get Amanda, open her eyes. She's in good hands, Betty. Yeah. It's just Amanda's time. Amanda's still unconscious. Me. I want you to listen to me. Are you listening to me? Amanda is on her way to the hospital. Be there with her. You've got to get me out of here. You just hold on. They're coming down for you right now. What the hell is the home? We can't go back that way. What are you saying? The ground's too soft. It'll give. Hey, there's a woman trapped down there. We have to dig. With what? Our hands? I'll put in a coat. Well, go, go. What's going on? Have you heard some crap? What's going on? Dr. Joe, thank you. Find your is she gonna be okay or what? Really no, cold. really. Cold. Body temp? 96 degrees. What is that? Get her in a warm bath. Trevor, I can't talk. What's Trevor, how long is she down there? How serious is this? Got your warm bath. You got your blanket. You got Dr. Joe. You got your dad. Next time you take a trip in February, we'll, let's take it in the car, okay? <laughs> Maybe we sit by a fire and have some hot cocoa and talk about it. Yes, sir, that's my baby. No, sir, don't mean maybe. Yes, sir, that's my baby now. Oh. She's in no danger at all. Oh, what about her body temperature? 98.6. On the nose.
Listen, Janet, I want you to calm down. I want you to do your best to conserve your air. It's a music box. There is a music box. It looks like a hot air balloon in it. On my bedside table, it's Linda. I want a minute to have it. Then you give it to her yourself, okay? I want her to have it. Please go get it. No. I'm not going anywhere until you're out of there. Do what I want. Janet, they're, they're digging a tunnel through you. Can you, can you hear the drilling? I may not ever see my little girl again. Janet, you're not going to be digging a tunnel. What if Amanda doesn't take it? She'll make it. She's going to make it, Janet. She'll make it because of you. I don't want you to talk anymore. I want you to just listen to me and you answer yes or no, okay? Now, can you hear that drilling? Think about is Amanda. What's that? Daddy! Daddy, you okay? We gotta break it up, Daddy. It feels like an earthquake. We gotta go down. She's gonna go down.
my children. Can't go quitting? Janet is counting on us. It may be too late. Jack, Amanda got out. That'll keep Janet going. The microphone isn't picking up any sound, and she's not pulling oxygen from the line we dropped down. Janet Green is going to go down. She's not coming down. I'm an expert on that. Janet Green is going to go down. She's not coming down. I'm an expert on that. They're trying to put together some kind of a last-ditch effort right now. Montgomery. Janet Green. We're heading up towards Montgomery. Head straight for the hospital. Janet Green. Jack, nothing happened when she talked to me, the right? The ground is firmer north of the well, Trevor. They're going to try to dig another tunnel, try to get in another way. We might as well pack it in, then. Good evening, Mike. How can they dig another tunnel to be out of here? Please. Who's in charge here? Bill me, Dylan. You and your men should be at the well trying to get Janet Green out of there. We've got men monitoring her. She's not getting any oxygen from that tube you put into the well. We'll get her out. It's what we do. Yeah, but I want her out alive. Oh, Trevor, Trevor, take it easy, will you? Please. You looking for a stronger place to dig a tunnel? Yes, that's our We only got one shot here, and you men are not communicating with her. Let Janet help us find Janet. She's unresponsive. We can only hope she found an air pocket. I'm going to try it out now. Will you get the camera oh, out of here? Trevor, it's a story. How about if I had Derek fold up your little tent here, Yeah, I'm huh? charge. Obstructing a rescue effort? I'm not in your way. You are in my way. Liza, please, give him some space. Derek, we have a right to monitor the situation. You exploited the situation. Get out. Aren't there some exteriors in the emergency vehicles coming in now? Thank you. Yes. Thank you? Whose side are you on? We are on the same side, Trevor. Janet's gasping for air. We're grasping at straws here. All right. Dylan, we've got the manpower and the equipment. And you don't know what the hell to do with them. So an ambulance outside. Is Janet out? No, 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 you have to the ambulance is standing by. Okay, listen. There's old plants for the mine at the main house. No, 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 no. No, no we don't got time. No, no, Janet, we need all the help we can get. No, we do know about the mine. Is there a way to cheat in there? If there's a way in, Trevor, it's in the plan. Well, again, we'll be here. Okay. Thanks, Edward. We look for the plans, we wait for the plan, and Janet dies. We're trying to send down another oxygen line without distressing the scene. Any ship can wait, and we won't have a prayer of saving her to get Janet the same way we got Amanda. Look, we can't, Trevor. It's filled with debris. No, no, it's too unstable. We thought this through. Oh, yeah, pal. You keep thinking Janet will be through. We cannot blast her out, Trevor. This has got to be done like surgery. There's another way if you want to listen to me. Trevor, you didn't see it, but we almost lost the lady. Huh? And I am not ordering a man down in that hole. You don't got to order me. Let me get Janet out. Oh, my God. What the hell do you think you're doing here? Are you willing to risk your life to save Janet Green? As soon as she's still alive. Amanda needs you. Yeah, she needed me last night, and I wasn't there. Janet was. She kept her warm. She kept her close. She kept her hopes up. Don't you think Janet owed you and Amanda that and a hell of a lot more? And now I owe Janet a life. No more loss. If I can do it right, I will. Good. If you had seen that second cave in, you would understand the chief's decision. Janet ain't going down for the count. Janet couldn't put up a fight in her state. Amanda showed signs of hypothermia. Yeah, she's got to be on the edge. I ain't arguing that. But you cannot risk your life for a lost cause. That's it, huh? That's the official call? Don't hurry, don't worry. We'll bring her up look, in a look, body look, bag. Look, this is their job, Trevor. Just let them do it, please. Survey is mapping from blueprints. Who drew these up, Leonardo da Vinci? We're lucky we have any. It's been a long time since this mine's been operable. It looks like you guessed right on the uh, location of the well. We dug the last chute on the outskirts of an old pond. When was that filled in? I can't say. It doesn't matter. It's fragile ground. Cave-in could have been worse. It'll just take a few seconds to shore it up. It's, we're not building no condo here. Slightly west of the chute, the pond bed. The spring's still active. You'd be sending Amanda drown in mud. Where are you plan on digging now? Opposite the first chute. That's stronger stuff. So do you think these plans are going to make a difference? I wish I'd gotten them sooner. Liza, this guy's ready to go on camera. Yeah, in a minute. No interviews. So, how's it feel to own a death trap? You ready to send off those lawsuits? Liza, what's going on here? The city EPA has a right to know, unless, of course, they've been bought off. What are you doing in here? 
There's a pool of reporters outside. I found Amanda and Janet. Well, good. You made yourself useful for once. Now get back in the pool. It's censorship, Edmund. This is my property. Get that cameraman out of here or I'll throw you out. Oh, I'm not in your way, am I? I'm a tempo sway. Because you're angling for an exclusive, is that it? Yeah, that's right. That's right. It's my story. I own it. Wow wins mine, and you're trespassing. This is an investigation because it's a crime scene. Well, that's news to me. Janet kidnapped Amanda. Wake up. Innocent until proven guilty? You're a little shaky on the fundamentals Look, I'm there. doing my job. You do your job. Oh, we have Derek uh, Miranda. Is he about oh, them? you have the right to no, remain silent. No, that's a real interesting sidebar. Gray, strong arm, WRCW to steal an exclusive. Come on. I'll tell you what. I'll take you outside. You own it in. I'll oh, show no. you where the pay phone. Great. So we'll dig slightly northwest of the first borough. If we can jack him or her up. We won't quit until we do. All right, all right, all right. All right, Trevor, let's get moved up. Trevor. The northern site is no good. 
What for that kid? I think he's looking to cut his losses, yeah. Cut his loss? Has he told Trevor? Nobody's nobody's found him. Nobody's seen him. Where is he? Maybe we should start looking. Well, don't just oh, stand there. Help me bring her back. Bring her to the bed. You can't... RJ, get some blankets. Yeah. Help me get her jacket off, will you? Tell me, you okay, buddy? I knew what you got. Somebody get some gauze. How'd you find her? Go get some gauze, would you please? Somebody call the EMT. Yep. Thanks. Any more at home like you? <laughs> Gloria, Gloria. What's the word on Janet? You gonna be okay? She has a few broken ribs. She's also being treated for exposure and hypoxia. What? Oh, oxygen deprivation. But she's going to be okay, right? Well, physically, Janet's out of the woods, and she's still worked up over Amanda. It hasn't sunk in that her... Say it. That her daughter's safe. I'll give you the good news. No, it's Trevor. Until Joe gives is okay, only immediate family should be in there with her. Yeah, but Janet got no branches on her family tree. You'll let me know when I can see it. Absolutely. In the meantime, there's a sleeping princess in pediatrics. <laughs> Amanda, show me to her. <laughs> Thanks, Ruth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's great. I can breathe again. Oh, I know that feeling. Have a seat. So, have you seen her yet? Well, she was asleep, but I just stood by her bed and took in an eyeful. I'm going to hold your brother big time for saving a man his life. Yeah. And Janet, for keeping her alive until the help got there. It's like she didn't give a second thought to the chances she was taking. Yeah, I know, same thing happened when she pulled Jamie out of Willow Lake. Seems as though she would have gone to her death happy as long as she knew Amanda was going to be okay. Hey, there's my girl. You know what? Hi, sweetheart. You like my beer that I got you? Huh? Hey, listen, Gorgeous, I got a special delivery for you. This is a Valentine's Get to, uh, Get Well card from Jamie. Everybody's so worried about you. Especially Janet. She's going to stop by real soon and see you. Make sure you're okay. What do you think of that? I want to read Jamie's card. Can I read Jamie's card with you? You know, what Janet did was kind of a valentine, too. She kept you warm. She kept you safe. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, that's cool. I have to get this little princess down to radiology. Okay, fine. Let me get back. Bye-bye, Peanut. -bye, I don't think, uh... Man is too keen on Janet, huh? Yeah, well, you gotta remember, Trev, she saw another side of Janet on that video. A not-so-nice side. Yeah, but it's also true. If it weren't for Janet risking her life, I wouldn't have Amanda. I wouldn't be able to hold her. I wouldn't be able to tell her I love her. Ted, how am I gonna tell Janet, thank you very much for risking your life and saving my kid, but my sweet little angel don't want to have anything to do with you. How you doing? How's Amanda? She's, uh, she's tired. She's a little cranky, but all systems go. Really? She even got a valentine from her, her buddy Jamie there. Valentine? Yeah, um, I got one for you. Valentine's Day. It's a miracle you